Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So, this is my daily video for Lineage Red Knights. Um, we're going to start the video off with just a arena fight. Um, this guy's ranked 19. I think I can take him on. I wait. Fuck, he has like all 5 stars. Probably going to get wrecked, but I... I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not too sure. I might be able to win. Like, his, his comp is pretty normal. It's just, uh... It's basically just like my comp, but instead of Death Knight, he's using Maria. Instead of, um... Instead of... The same heroes, or instead of uh, what's 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 her name? Instead of Lara, he's using um, uh, he's using the other one, Ashley. I, I suddenly forgot her name. Holy shit! Oh my god, I, I'm wrecked. This is this is GG. Five star Adele too strong. Like I I can't beat her with my three star Adele. It's just it, it it doesn't work. Anyways, um. We're gonna we're gonna do do raids. We're gonna do summons. Um, basically everything we need to do today. And they also changed the arena system. You get you get ten fights a day now. I think this is better. Like I, there's really no downside to to them um, changing this. All you really need to do is make sure to do all your arenas, and um, you actually get more shit. Like the they changed the gold reward, so you actually get more gold now. And also. Um, you can get you can you can clear these a lot easier. These win coliseum battle missions and stuff. It's a lot more. It's a lot easier to clear because all you really need to do is um, is do do your arena fights and you can pretty much uh, you can just clear through all this. And then it gives you extra extra points to buy PVP gear. So we're gonna. Oh wait, I actually I think I actually uh, got ahead of myself today and I already did the. I already did the time rift, but I, I didn't do the Tower of Insolence. Um, I did the time rift because I needed to do to complete a destiny for my Adele. That was basically it. We're gonna see how I do on the on the tower today. See if that stupid vampire spawns. Um, still trying to farm him. It's 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 so hard I'm trying to get that vampire. I I have a theory. I have a theory for the tower. Um, my theory is that if you if you um, if you pop your transformation, you're more likely to get the boss spawn. That's my theory. All right. Because every time I, I do actually use my transformation, that it's more likely that the boss comes out. Just might be might be some stupid superstition. Also, I switched back to my original main main comp. I mean, I mean, I I tried a lot of units. Um, see, the boss just came out. Look, look at this. All right, make sure always to pop your transformation. Make make sure the it makes sure the boss that um that you want want to farm comes out. Oh yeah, so um my main main comp, my main team, the the team I've been using since like the beginning of time. I basically switched back. I've been trying to use Diane. I've been trying to run run like different tanks like. Um, Zenith Queen and and the the guy you get for free like B Bafflement or something. Um, yeah, I've been trying to run those those units, but I I still think Adele's still the strongest tank. My worst regret is not buying two more Adele packs. But I don't think I even have the money to do that anyway. So I guess you know I really can't do that. But I mean, if I had a four star Adele, I can definitely uh, definitely stay in top twenty. I think um, definitely would have beat that guy just now. The guy with a five-star Adele. If I, if I ha at least had a four-star Adele, I think. Um, there's a lot of people running the dragon. I think I definitely maybe want to start raising that dragon. I tried to use Diane, but I think Diane's kind of shit. <laughs> like it's, I, I um, I didn't want to be this blunt, all right? I didn't want to be this blunt, but I think Diane's kind of shit. Oh shit! I forgot to pop my transformation. I think I'm fucked. Yeah, see, I didn't pop my transformation and the boss didn't come out, so... Make sure to pop your transformation, always. It makes it so the boss is more likely to come out. Just my random superstition. My my original concept was, like, since I, I'm able to farm Diane more easily, I can use her for armor break. And it's easier to get her to 4 stars. But she's a lot weaker than... Um, then I think the dragon guy that everybody uses. Wait, did I pop my transformation or did I forget again? I think I forgot again. Oh shit! I need to stop being distracted. I need to stop talking and stop being distracted. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop it right at the beginning. All right, we're gonna pop this thing right in the beginning. It's gonna make sure I transform, and that stupid vampire comes out.
Alright, he's gonna come out now. He's gonna come out now. Alright. Oh my god, what the f Alright, how many more runs do I have? I think I have two more. Okay, last chance, last chance. Last chance for him to come out today. I honestly think they nerfed the, the raids in the tower. Like, I think everyone's just been farming too hard. But I don't think they should nerf the raids. They should honestly increase the raids, I think. If you if you compare it to all the other farmable units in the game, like it's so much harder to get the pieces for um for monsters in the tower, I think. But that's just my random opinion. Ooh, such horrible, horrible luck. Alright, I think I'm on, on four forty nine, I think. Or maybe forty I'm already on fifty. Let me just uh, let me just check 50. If I can't do 50, I go back to 49. All right, I'm on 49. Basically, always use my last ticket. If you only have one ticket left, use it to progress. Use it to uh, to get as far as possible. But I think I'm reaching the top very soon because like 49, and then it's 50, and then the the top floor is 60 right now. So I should be there very very soon. Just. Um, Few more days of horrible, horrible luck, and I should be there. All right. <laughs> oh my god! And the boss comes out. What is this bullshit? That's so sad. Having him come out right when I don't have any tickets left. Um. All right, back to back to another PVP fight, and I'll see if I can do a raid. And then if not, then I'll I'll just summon, and this will be kind of a shorter video because I didn't do the time rift today. Oh, this guy's in chaos! Holy shit! How do they have like all six star monsters? How how much did they f pay to to get that? Like how do, how much did you have to pay to get this? Oh, uh, this this reminds me. This this comp actually reminds me. Um, the Spartoi and this the Golem is actually very very strong. They're they're both really really strong units, and I've actually raised them to like a certain level to help me clear through through a lot of stuff. I think that comp that that comp just now was pretty strong. I should probably refresh and try to find it again. I, I was kind of curious. I, I kind of do want to want to try it out. Damn it! I mean, there's only like I, I think that was it. I think I accidentally clicked too fast. There's only like 20 people here on this, like when I refresh. Like 20 possible people I can get. I should definitely be able to find them again. Yeah, there's a lot of comps. Like if you look at look at um, what people are running. Well, this guy's actually running Diane. That's that's actually pretty interesting. I thought Diane was shit. <laughs> um, but there's a lot of people running that dragon guy. If you, if I refresh a few times, you should definitely see one. All right, um, you should definitely see one very soon. See this one, this one, this this dragon. I think I want to want to raise that one. That might be the stronger armor breaker. How do they have like six stars? If you get a monster to six stars max level, that's pretty much maxed out. Like you can't get any stronger than that. Okay, I give up. I give up. There's no way I can find that golem guy again. It's gone. We're we're just gonna have to. We're just gonna have to give up. I'm gonna find a comp that I can actually beat, I think. Oh, this guy I could probably beat. He's only... He's two levels lower than me. Running a double healer comp. Time to get wrecked. Dang, that Owen nerf. That Owen nerf is rough. There's a lot of experimental comps that I want to try out in this game, but it's just so hard because your your resources in the game are super limited. Oh shit, this is bad. If my Adele falls before hers, it's going to be really bad. Oh wait, it's GG. Yeah, I have my nuke up. Oh damn, that was that was close. She just used her nuke right at the last second. Wait, I was higher rank than that guy. Oh rip, rip. I thought I was able to progress in my rankings, but I think at least now I'm I'm able to stay in top 100, and there's no, there's there's really no benefits unless you can get you can stay in top 10. 
and top 10 is impossible like top 10 is just literally all six stars now like pretty much um if i if i can get to like top 20 i can probably see refresh and see the list for top 10 but top 10 is like impot it's 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 crazy like everybody has full six stars in top 10 all right there's no raid uh, i'm gonna do my daily summons also open some boxes because i i didn't get to open them yesterday let's hope i get something something decent all right let's do the let's do the free one all right it's a coin and let's see which pieces i get for today please be something good oh it's uh it's a new um estelle all right two more two more of uh her pieces and i'll be able to get her Definitely want more monsters, because um, the more monsters you have, you, you can use them for guild battles and stuff. So there's, um, yeah, there's there's that. that. That was pretty much it. So, box opening, yes. I have a lot of random boxes. I have no idea what's, what are the, in these. I think they're, you only get pieces for like one stars. Hmm. I think getting some spar toy would be pretty nice. Definitely want to get him to four stars eventually. He's he's definitely a really good monster. All right, it's a chicken. Oh, I have seven raid boss boxes. See if I can get an epic loot from this. Nope. Nope. What 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 did I expect? What did I expect? Oh, never lucky. Well, these skill chests are actually pretty good. A lot of times you do get some nice stuff, like Breath of Fire. Yes, Uncommon Emerald, dude. This is so good. I fucking love this shit. And Dark Elemental Stone. That that that, that shit's pretty good for crafting, I think. All right, we got some Flaming Archer. I got five boxes. Let's open them at the same time and see if I get five pieces. Nice, ten pieces. Ten pieces is pretty nice. You know what that means? I can get my Archer to three stars. I I actually stopped uh farming this this guy. Like it's it's too difficult probably to get him to to four stars, but I have exactly enough pieces. Yeah, I, I had exactly enough pieces to um to get him to three stars, so I mean that was pretty nice. That was that was that was pretty good actually. That was that was really good. I think I'm gonna start stopping the event because there's no real reason for me to um to do that. And I think I can power up my cube. I've had such horrible, horrible luck. Like I, I got to um, plus seven in the beginning, and then you know how the cube refreshes after you don't power up for two days, and then I powered down to plus six. And I was trying to get get it back to plus seven. I had like twenty tickets, and it, it just would not get to plus seven. Like it would get to plus six and then fail each time. Oh my god! Look at this shit. Just it's impossible to get to plus seven. I'm I'm gonna have to go another day with it being plus six. God damn it! <laughs> I'm so tilted. I'm so that that cube made me so tilted. Um. Anyways, that's the end of the video. That's um that's everything I had to do today. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um. Yeah, I was gonna do. Uh, I was probably gonna do a video in the future. Um, talking a little bit more about the stone golem and spartoy, like how I use them to cheese through certain levels. So I'll definitely um do that in the near future. I think it's definitely gonna be a really really helpful vid video for not just new player players, but like majority of the player base. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.